I'm going to show you how to add a chemistry lecture and lab to your schedule. So first get to your Add Drop Classes worksheet and then we are going to select Class Search. We'll go to Chemistry, Course Search, and then Chemistry 1150. Um, so it'll show all of the sections that are available. When you see a C instead of a checkbox here, um, this means the course is closed. For chemistry, there are not, there are no wait lists, and so if you really wanted to take this particular section, um, that's not going to be an option. You're going to want to choose one of the other three. So let's say we decide to take this lecture, which is Monday, Wednesday, Friday, from 8 a.m. to 8:50. Um, we can go ahead and select the checkbox and then add to worksheet. So now our chemistry lecture is on our add drop worksheet, but we're not done yet. We need to add the lecture in the lab simultaneously, um, which means we need to have both CRNs down here. CRN is the course registration number. It's the five digit number. So we will hit class search again. Um, that CRN will stay on the worksheet, but if you want to be really thorough, you can also write it down just in case. Um, we'll do course search, and then Chem 1151 is the corresponding lab, and we will decide on which lab we want. So, something to keep in mind, when you're first building your schedule, like we are, um, there aren't any time conflicts yet, right? But you want to keep in mind when the other course was. So we had selected a Monday, Wednesday, Friday course. So obviously the Monday, Wednesday, the Wednesday lab would not work for us, but the Tuesday lab would be a great option. Um, something else to note on the lab sections, the lab goes from 8 a.m. to 10.50 a.m. Um, just with how the scheduling system works, it breaks up that time, but you will be in class from 8 a.m. to 10.50 a.m. Um, so let's say we want to take this one. Once again, we'll scroll down, add to worksheet, and then we can submit changes. Now you're enrolled in Chemistry 1150 and 1151. Now let's say you decide, mm, I don't want to take an 8 a.m. lecture, and there were other options. So we can do course search. Go back to chemistry, 1150, and say you want to take the 11 a.m. instead of the 8, you'll add to worksheet. Now your new lecture is added to the worksheet. You come to this drop down box, select Wed Drop, and submit changes. You have to do that simultaneously because if you don't, you will get an error, and depending on how full the classes are, you could find yourself in a situation where you have no chemistry instead of the chemistry that you need. So if you're seeing that and there's only like a seat left, and of course I wouldn't recommend changing on your schedule unless you absolutely have to, um, but that is how you would swap out um, the lecture in the lab. You can't drop them and keep one of them. You have to drop and add simultaneously because the lecture and the lab are co-requisites to one another which means you have to take them at the same time and that is how you add a chemistry lecture and lab to your schedule.